trying to quit smoking cigarettes uh, is not going great. Because the thing I like most about smoking is like the break you can take from people. That's the <laughs> best part. You know, you're out and about, you're feeling a little crowded, you can step outside, have a cigarette. So now that I'm not smoking, when I want a break, what I'll do is I'll go to the bathroom and I'll just hang out. I just go in there, I'll pace around, I will not poop nor pee, I will just kill time. But sometimes I'll go in the bathroom and somebody will have peed on the toilet seat and so I can't leave the bathroom with the pee on the seat, people are going to think I peed on the seat. So what do I do? I go, I cleaned it up. But now it's happening so often that this smoking cigarettes, I'm just cleaning toilets. <laughs> and I'm not sure that's better, I'm pretty sure I still get cancer. So. Uh, I've been trying to appreciate the little things not smoking though. You know, like the little thrills in life. I've been getting really into yawning. Ooh. It's good stuff. Yawning is what I imagine it's like to be raptured. Or like beamed up by an alien. It feels cool. I think the coolest thing about yawning is just talking about yawning can make you yawn. Uh -huh. Thinking about yawning can make you yawn. Seeing somebody else yawning will make you yawn. It makes life exciting. Like if I'm walking down the street and I see a dude yawn, I'm just like, oh, oh curveball. Okay. Oh, man. I didn't know we were doing this today. Hey, where's it coming from? Whoa. When's it going to get here? Maybe it's not coming. Ah, whoa. Thank you, dude. Appreciate it. I like yawning. I like sneezing. Oh, God, sneezing. Did anybody else get hype as, as toot when they sneeze? Every, every time I sneeze, I want to crack my neck and shadow box. It's a bigger end. But what's really good, what's really amazing is sneezing in public. Oh, sneezing in public. What else can you do in life where you just yell and then everybody blesses you? What? I don't know why we do it, but it seems so valuable for our sanity, you know? Because people get so pent up and so tense in life that you can just go out in public and be like, uh, and everybody's like, hey, it's going to be okay. God's got you, buddy. Get your blessings. You're good. I think we need that. I think we need to sneeze. If you're out in public, don't, don't hold it in. You know, let it out. Really let it go. Because I got a theory that every serial killer is just one of these people that held in all their sneezes just like... <laughs> You're old enough, you just, you got a knife and you're killing hookers. It's crazy. Okay. I don't know, I like sneezing in public. It, it's funny though, you, you know your body wants to sneeze because the closer it gets to a sneeze, the more excited it gets. It's just like, ah, uh, ah, uh, ah. Uh. <laughs> then you let it out. But if you sneeze a bunch in public, it's... Is crazy because people get like excited for you. You let out a bunch of sneezes, they're just like they'll talk to you across the restaurant, just like, hey, oh, oh, oh allergies? Is it allergies? Oh, what's your name? You're a wild man. <laughs> Karen, come meet Mike. But if you cough a lot in public, people would be like, hey, will you die somewhere else?